optically see-through near-eye displays are designed for overlaying computer-generated graphics onto a real-world scene. However, their current optical designs limit their field of view to usually less than 40 degrees diagonal, thus limiting the viewer's immersion in the augmented reality scene. Foveer is a novel augmented reality system that extends the field of view of the near-eye displays by projecting additional graphics in the viewer's periphery. In Foveer, the user wears optically see-through glasses capable of displaying 3D stereoscopic views. The glasses are tracked using an overhead vision-based motion tracking system. In addition to the glasses, Foveer also uses a projector and a Microsoft Kinect camera to enable spatially registered view-dependent projections. Because of this unique combination of displays, the user can experience correct perspective views both in their glasses and in their periphery. The simplest configuration is to show identical content in both the projection and the glasses. Alternatively, we can project only around the glasses, thus effectively creating an occlusion shadow for the content in the glasses. A more creative combination is to use the projected inset to project only the graphics that is changing the appearance of existing real-world objects, such as the brick wall texture here. The stereo glasses are used to display all other virtual 3D models. Finally, we can apply a blended transition between the projected inset and the periphery to reduce visual discontinuities. It is also possible to use other semantic knowledge to decide where to display content. For example, we can show the player's cards only in their glasses for privacy or keep virtual objects in the projection when they are close to their respective projection surfaces. We have implemented four different experiences to showcase the capabilities of VR. The first experience shows a helicopter moving around the room. Notice that the projected spotlight on the wall is a surface shaded effect visible only in the projection. Also, glasses allow the viewer to keep track of the helicopter even when it flies outside of the projection area. Our second experience shows a Rube Goldberg machine where different balls travel along the virtual shelves and the real furniture in the room. Hey. Hey, how's it going? Good, good. So, I'm going to try to use this 3D We also experimented you, with life-size 3D so, virtual so telepresence. Notice that while it is impossible to keep the entire person visible in the glasses, the projection fills in all the relevant peripheral details. This allows the viewer to shift their focus without losing the overview of their partner. Finally, our shooter game allows the player to control a virtual character via a game controller. The character runs around the surfaces of the room fighting the attacking sock puppets. The player benefits from having a wide field of view and by seeing all game characters as 3D objects in their stereo glasses. These full VR experiences showcase the complementary nature of the stereo glasses and the view-dependent projection for creating more immersive augmented reality experiences.